Hello. Welcome to All A Plus Essays. The best among the best. My name is Julie and I will be your instructor as we read through a commemorative speech essay. The article source is embedded in the video description below. Feel free to read along. Please note that you can get a custom, plagiarism-free essay for as little as $10 a page at All A Plus Essays. The link is in the description. A commemorative speech are speeches of praise or celebration. This speaker aims of the speech is to pay tribute to a person, a group of people, an institution, or an idea. Each speech that you will give has a purpose. In a commemorative speech the main purpose is inspire your audience. This speaker is trying to arouse and heighten the audience's appreciation of or admiration for the person, institution, or idea you are praising. When giving a commemorative speech it is important for the speaker to express feelings that connects with what you're talking about. You want to capture the audience and invite them in and let them see why you are giving praise to whatever it is you might be. A commemorative speech depends mostly on the creative and subtle use of language. When giving a commemorative speech it is most successful when this speaker is meaningful and inspiring with the use of language. Your ability to put your real thoughts and emotions into your words can great benefit how the audience will react to what you have said. This speaker will have a greater effect on grabbing the audience's attention if he or she focuses on specific details for example tone, repetition, and vivid language. The book gives us an example of how a few changes to the opening of a speech can have a dramatic effect. Using these specific language techniques can also keep the audience interested in what the speaker is saying. A commemorative speech is about praising or celebrating something and if we were to stand up and give a speech in a monotone voice then it wouldn't seem like we were praising or celebrating anything. Specific language techniques that would be appropriate for a commemorative speech would be metaphor, simile, parallelism, repetition, antithesis, and alliteration. As a speaker your biggest challenge is to get the audience to imagine what you're saying. Christenings, weddings, funerals, graduations, Award ceremonies, inaugurals, and retirement dinners are all examples of commemorative speeches. If the speaker does not pay specific detail to the use of language then the speech will not be successful. Thank you for taking your time to listen to me. I hope you enjoyed learning about a commemorative speech essay as much as I did. Kindly remember that you can get a custom, plagiarism-free essay at All A Plus Essays for as little as little as $10. The link is in the description. See you next time.